Hi, this is Tracy HD, and I'm here to do the weekly Oracle and Tarot card reading, and I am using the messages from the Mermaid's Oracle. If you'd like to purchase this deck, click the link in the description box below, and you can use this as a pick a card reading, one, two, or three, or a blended reading for the beginning, middle, and end of the week. As I shuffle the deck, I'm asking all light beings, angels, and God, please relay the message and each share with my viewers the highest good of all. For the beginning of the week, or card one, I'll pick the top card. For the middle of the week or card two, we are going to take a card from the center. And the end of the week or card three will be the bottom card. Okay, and I hope we don't have any wind here to uh, help us with this reading. And let's see what card number one is. Card number one is going to be move forward. Okay. And what a beautiful, beautiful card this is. And this warrior king of the sea strides boldly forward and asks you to do the same. He says, this is the time to make a move. So follow him. Whatever it is that you've been thinking about doing, this card says to do it now. You might not feel ready or you could be waiting for the perfect moment to take action. Well, that perfectly imperfect moment is now. The time for inaction or procrastination is over. You know in your heart that the current circumstances can't stay the same and bold action is required. It might not be a life-changing move, or there again it could be. You'll know what you need to do, so act with courage as you boldly move forward and trust in life to guide you. And then the middle of the week, or those of you that picked card number two, is trust. Yeah, these two go together perfectly, moving forward and trusting. You know, trusting that this is the right thing to do and trusting yourself above all. And this mermaid says everything is working out perfectly and for the highest good of all. Even if it doesn't feel that way right now, it's important to put your trust in life and know that all is well. Sometimes we could feel like a feather in the wind, blown this way and that way, feeling out of control. Yet the truth is we're never truly in control. Allow your heart and inner wisdom to guide you through your situation, knowing that your sun will rise and shine once again. When our rational mind becomes dominant and our need to control takes over, life could be challenging. Yet within our mind, we also have the power to turn things around and surrender to our destiny as it unfolds. Even if it feels uncomfortable, know that your journey is unfolding exactly as it should and there's nothing to concern yourself about. And then at the end of the week, or those of you that picked card number three, we have awareness. And what a beautiful, beautiful mermaid. And this card is telling us, this mermaid wants you to know that it's time to ground yourself and become more aware. Your senses may be heightened at this time. Being aware of potential scenarios can aid you as you swim through calm or troubled waters. Notice the details as you float through your life. Your awareness is a beautiful and natural gift that can offer insights even before a situation has fully revealed itself. Clairvoyants and mediums have a heightened sense of awareness on the earthy and spiritual planes. Perhaps you're developing your sixth sense. If so, this card confirms it's the correct path for you and that your gift of heightened awareness can benefit others as well as yourself. Meditation is a wonderful way to enhance your awareness. When you meditate, it can help to put you in a place of enhanced feeling and seeing on many levels. So you automatically become more aware. Develop your perception by meditating with awareness as your intention and focus. When you become more aware, you tend to notice things you may otherwise not have seen. Awareness can also help you to foresee any potential challenges in your life, therefore enabling you to take action to avert certain circumstances. There might be someone around you who could benefit by becoming more aware. They or you could be too close to a situation to see it clearly. Therefore, consciously focusing on awareness will help you or them to see the situation from a place of heightened perception. What a beautiful, beautiful week. So we're going to move forward. This is the green light. It, it's go time, okay? <laughs> no more procrastinating. If we're waiting for the perfect moment, no, no moment's ever going to be perfect. Believe me. Trust. Trust that you know what you're doing and that whatever you do, all is going to work out in divine timing 
in divine ways and you know you're doing the right thing and, and even if we fail at something we still learned a lesson and heightened awareness get some quiet time go into meditation maybe take a walk in nature what a beautiful message this week if you've enjoyed the reading please hit the like button to help the channel grow drop a comment down below if this has resonated with you if you'd like to purchase this amazing deck click the link in the description box but above all subscribe because i will be back with more